Okay, we're going to test some FPS here. So what I have here is the Competition Electronics Pro Chrono DLX. This is one of the better FPS testers on Amazon. Uh, there's plenty of them around $60. This is about $150. So it's a lot better one. Um, and it should be more accurate. So that's why I went with this instead. So first off, we're going to test the stock M4. So nothing's been changed on this one. I've just got the regular battery. We're just going to go ahead and start shooting. I don't think you guys can see the output on here because of the glare of the sun. What I'm going to do is I'll attach a screenshot of the results after I do all this. When I make the video, I'll go ahead and attach a screenshot of the results. All right, so we're going to go ahead and start shooting. All right, so I went ahead and did that all the way through. So what I need to do is then I have to open up the app and it's on the same phone I'm recording on. So I will go ahead and attach that uh, screenshot. It'll show you all the FPS shot by shot actually at an average. So far I've done several different rounds with this gun and you know it gets as high as um, 240 FPS. Um, and then, you know, it just ranges anywhere between 200 and 240, averages around 220 or so, so far. So that's what I've seen with it so far. We'll try it with a bigger battery and see if that makes a difference.